It's rare to have one set of twins and incredibly rare to have two sets of twins, but that's exactly what happened to Casey and Eugene. The odds of having two sets of twins oh. is one in 70,000. Wow. So, you know, this beautiful, the second beautiful set of twins are these beautiful twins. They were monoamniotic, monochorionic twins. Sometimes you hear people call them Momo twins or Mono Mono twins. And what this means is that they are in one amniotic sac, so monoamniotic, one big water balloon, and monochorionic means that there is one placenta. And so people get excited because they're gonna be identical twins. Interestingly, 75% of Mono Mono twins will be female, but during the pregnancy, it's actually really high risk because they are monoamniotic, so in one big sac, then when the babies are moving around, the umbilical cords can get tangled up. And as you can imagine, that can be life-threatening. And because they're monochorionic, then they can start to share some blood vessels abnorm abnormally. And sometimes one baby will get too much nourishment and the other baby won't get enough, so that can also be dangerous. Luckily, it looks like these twins did very well, yeah. but yeah, they definitely One defied the odds One beautiful family. This. Have you ever seen Momo twins? I have. Really? Yeah. Wow, that's, yeah, that's pretty cool with yeah. how rare it is. Yeah, it is, it's very cool. And I mean, like I said, these moms, they have a lot of monitoring, they have a lot of ultrasounds and all that good stuff. They usually end up in the hospital during the pregnancy because it's high risk and they have a lot going on. But yeah, it's, it's fun once they're born. <laughs> yes. And since the first set were twin boys and then the second set were twin girls, the twin girls have bodyguards, essentially. Yes, they do. <laughs> that's what I said. Do <laughs>